welcome to Ohio Valley Couponer. So today we're here with Kroger Couponing Deals for April 15th through April 21st of 2020. We do have two freebies this week, which hey, two freebies is better than no freebies, right? Am I right? Yeah. Um, yeah, so it's actually a decent week at Kroger. Now, a lot of you guys, uh, um, I've been getting questions like, when's the next Mega? Do you know when Easter clearance is? I don't know the answers to any of that. I've not been to Kroger since March 14th in store, actually. Um, I only go off based off what the ads tell me. I would assume that they marked Easter stuff down 50%. This week would be my assumption. That's what I'm pretty sure they would have done. So if you're in Kroger, you might want to look at the Easter stuff if they have any left. I think they would have marked it down 50%. As for like mega events and stuff, I don't think they're going to run them for a long time, to be honest, due to this virus. I think they are still trying to give us sales, which we need to just be thankful for that because a lot of these stores have totally cut sales. Meyer cut sales. I believe Publix cut sales. Most of the stores are just not doing sales anymore. So I'm really thankful Kroger is still giving us something. Like it really helps. And just made one of the great reasons why I really like Kroger because they're still thinking of us during this time. I'm not going to go through the whole the whole thing here, but I just want to remind you guys, this is videos and no means an encouragement to anyone to go shopping. I would urge everyone to stay home if they can, but I am sharing these deals for people who still need groceries and still need to save money. So that's where we're getting at with that. Remember, any rude comments will be deleted and could result in you not like getting to watch my videos anymore. It could get you blocked. So just remember that before you leave a mean comment. So yeah. And then finally, just want to remind everyone, keep supporting your YouTubers. I'm not on here to make drama, but you know, it's been really rough lately. So I just want to remind you, these are ways you can keep supporting your YouTubers. Let the ads play, print any coupons or use any affiliate links they offer. Maybe you haven't signed up for Ibotta yet. This is a great time to use somebody's code and sign up. Watch any old videos you're interested in. A lot of our channels, like I know for myself, I have lots of vlogs, um, tips, good couponing tip videos that will do you way after this virus ends. So lots of great videos. I've been watching a lot of other old videos. I know my own identity. I watch some of her like planner videos and vlog type stuff. I've just been trying to watch other people um, on YouTube. And remember, you can let videos play while you're doing your chores. You can even mute them. You don't have to sit there and listen to the whole thing. You can just let them play on another tab on your computer while you're doing something else if that's what you want to do. Just reminding you guys, there are lots of ways to help support your favorite YouTubers during this extremely rough time. You wouldn't think it would hurt a YouTuber, but it has. So just want to remind you guys, those are some great ways you can help support myself and other awesome content creators here on YouTube. So yeah, let's get right into this. First up, we got the Once Upon a Farm smoothies. These are $2.89. We are going to submit for the $2.89 I bought an offer. That is going to make your net price totally free. Hopefully they let this one stay good for a while. And then we're going to submit for, okay, some people have an additional $0.10 cent I bought it for a probiotic drink. I don't know. Um, my account has it. Maybe yours does too. This could be a $0.10 cent moneymaker if you're able to get your hands on that rebate. So awesome. All right. This one comes every week, but it keeps resetting. The banana is 25 cents at Kroger. We have a 25 cent Ibotta. Or, I'm sorry, not Ibotta. It's a Checkout 51. So, um, yeah. So that ends up making it free. Remember, the Checkout 51 has lots of good rebates right now on like bread, um, eggs, and bananas. So really awesome little freebie. You can get a single banana. Or if you buy a whole bunch, you know, you can just get 25 cents off. So really awesome, but potential freebie there. Kroger is like really stepping it up on produce. I'm so happy with them for that. They got the grapes. They are 99 cents a pound, which is an unbelievable kind of price for those. Like really an awesome, awesome deal. Then we also have two for three for cantaloupe, which is great. And then this is really good too. Three for five for strawberries. That is the cheapest we've seen so far. Um, that's a really, really great price for strawberries. So, you know, Kroger's really got you hooked up on produce this week. Great deal. Okay, this almost, this is weird. This deal brought back some normalcy for me because this is the deal Kroger runs like constantly. So it was kind of exciting to see a deal, you know, kind of show up. I don't know. I'm kind of weird like that. But the Intimate Little Bites and the Thomas English Muffins are buy one, get one. These are $3.99. So that just essentially makes them $1.99 each. Remember, there is a difference if your store is a true BOGO store like mine, which means the first one rings up $3.99, and then the second rings up zero. Some of you guys only have to buy one, and it'll simply ring up half price at $1.99. So make sure you know what kind of store you're in. Just check your app, type in Thomas, 
and it'll tell you. If it says buy one, get one free, that means you have to buy two. If it says $1.99, you just have to buy one. Okay, Keebler cookies are $1.99. We're going to utilize a 75 cent coupon from 3.8 Retail Me Not. I decided to put insert coupons back in this week because honestly, there's no printable coupons out hardly right now. So, you know, some of us still have been getting paper coupons. So I thought I'd just throw them in. We have a 75 cent coupon from 3.8 Retail Me Not. So it makes the cookies $1.24. That's a good one. And then I just want to remind you, the club and townhouse, you know, that's not a bad deal. $1.99 is not a bad price at all. Those are regularly like $4.29, so definitely not a bad deal um, on the crackers. This is really rare to see a deal on checks. This is weird. This doesn't happen that much. Usually only around the holidays, so. It's $1.88. We have a dollar off of two coupon from the $3.29 Smart Source. Makes it $1.38 per box of checks. That is really good for checks. That stuff, you don't get that on sale ever, like ever. So if you like this cereal and you are doing a click list, because remember, you can absolutely do these deals with per click list. They do not have to be done in the store. Or if you are still going in the store, you can do this either way, but it's a good time to stock up on your check cereal. And if you need more information about click list, always remember, I have that whole entire click list tutorial video that I'll try to link here, but I'm not sure. Lately, the iCards haven't been working right, so um, yeah. Okay, we got Chobani Greek yogurt. It's 99 cents, and this is cool. Usually they say you must buy eight or 10, but now they're just letting you buy whatever you want. And that's really, I think that's because they're not wanting people to clear the shelves and stuff. So good job, Kroger. 99 cents, you're gonna buy five at 4.95. We're gonna utilize a dollar off five coupon from the 329 Smart Source. And then we are going to submit for the dollar off of five Saving Star. That's gonna make your net price $2.95 for five of the yogurts. Or, you know, that essentially breaks down to 59 cents each. Not too shabby. I don't even think you can get the, I think the Kroger Greek yogurt is like 75 cents. So, you know, to get it for that is definitely not a bad price at all. Okay, this is not a good deal. I'm just throwing this in there for somebody who is in need of detergent. I don't know. I just thought I'd throw it in. And oh, I gotta give credit. All the pictures of coupons are from cliptosave.com. Cliptosave is a Coupon clipping service, I have no affiliations or anything with them. I just always feel like if I take a picture from their website or something that I should give credit and tell you guys about them. So you can buy coupons, clipped coupons from them um, for a small fee. So that's always a good resource. If you need a lot of a certain coupon, you know, they will have you covered on Clip to Save. So good website. And they also put the insert preview. It's my favorite place to look at it. All right, so it's $5.99. We're going to use a $2 coupon from the PNG. So it'd be $3.99 if you need it. Don't go get this if you don't need it, but if you're desperate for it, you know. Okay, we got the Nature Valley bars. They are $1.88 this week. We have a 75 cent digital coupon. So it makes it $1.13. That's a pretty good deal for a box of granola bars. Fiber One is also on sale. We don't have a digital. I believe we have a 50 cents off of two paper coupon from 329 Smart Source. Still not a bad price for these bars at all. So if you want to have some like snacks for your kids, you know, anytime I think you can get bars around the dollar fifty, not a bad deal. And there's twelve bars in there, so you know, definitely anytime you can get them for around the dollar fifty or so, I think that's winning. So not a bad deal at all. All right, everybody needs a little chocolate in their lives, especially now during all this. Um, so you know, the Nestle single serve bars are fifty cents. We have a digital coupon for fifty cents off too, but the Cool news is we also got that coupon in the 4 or 5 Smart Source. So if you got the paper coupon, you can use that. But if you've not been getting the paper, digital option available for you. So you're going to utilize that coupon and you're going to get these bars for 25 cents, which is a great price down from the usual 99 cent price. This is one of those moments I remember at Kroger all the time when we had double coupons that we could get these for free all the time. Candy was one of the items that double couponing was, was free, but you know what, 25 cents, that's 75% off, and this could be great to have in your house right now. Maybe you bribe your kids to do their schoolwork right or something, and you give them some candy. No, that's probably ridiculous. So, yeah, um, just trying to make some humor here. So, yeah, 25 cents, not too shabby. Okay, and I thought this was an honorable mention. You know, not a bad deal on this Olay. If you use Olay, if you're into these fancy moisturizers, you might want this. So, they're $24.99. And you're going to buy an Olay wipe for $6.99. There's a digital coupon. If you buy this moisturizer, you get the wipes for free. So that takes off $6.99. And that makes your net price $24.99 for both of them. So, eh, I don't know. Do with that what you will. 
So that's all I have for this video. I looked for more deals. There are just really not many there. But I think Kroger did a good job this week giving us some things with cheap cereal, produce, you know, snacky stuff. I think that's what a lot of you guys need right now. Keep watching the channel. Um, I'm still here. I'm still trying my best to bring you guys deals. And thank you so much for watching.